the eyedropper tool in this tutorial we will learn about the eyedropper tool this tool is amazing and it lets us pick the colors from the image itself so let's go forward and talk about this tool the eyedropper tool helps to pick up any color any color with any color I mean actually you can go ahead and choose the color from your image the hotkey is I which have so when you click I you press I on the keyboard this tool is activated you can click anywhere on your image to define the foreground color like your foreground color which we have discussed earlier and also by all clicking click holding the alt key we can select the background color so in your foreground and your background your colors will automatically be sampled be selected when we use the eyedropper tool so let's go ahead and do it ourselves in Photoshop let's dive in in this tutorial let's see how we can use the amazing colors in this image and get them to our color panel so this is where my color panel is my swatch is and this is my color panel so I want actually to pick up these colors from the image so I press I which is the short key for this tool here the eyedropper tool so let me just click here just can you see here in my foreground whichever wherever I'm clicking one it's adding to my swatch and it's adding here so I'm just clicking anywhere and I'm sampling those color so if I want to sample a color for my background right now wherever I'm clicking I have a copy in the foreground what if I want that wherever I click my even my background color should change so I'm going to press alt and then I press here so now you can see that I'm actually changing my background color as well so let me just like this color now if I want to write something here I'm going to type in T which is for the text tool and I'm going to use these colors I'm going to swap my colors my foreground and my background let me write something maybe let me write butterflies so I just the use I just use the color from the background into my type tool by making it my foreground color so this is how cool the eyedropper tool is in the next tutorial we're going to talk about the color sample tool